So let's talk about the third section here. Let's talk about a let's make a bad mesh and talk about it. So I'm going to reopen this one that we know is open. And no wireframe, shut the ground plane off. And this is common, you know, you'll get a part from an animator. And they'll, your, boss, your boss will come down usually at, I don't know, 4.50 on a Friday. And say, hey, I got this thing, I want you to print it. So you're going to say, okay, very first thing you're going to do is just grab everything and join just to see what you can do with it. We're going to sell open polysurf and let's just focus on this piece for now. Get rid of that because we don't need it. Get rid of this because we don't care. And find out where our holes are. All right. Now, we know from before the way we're going to fix this is we're just going to hack this off and we're going to cap it because our grill sits in there and we don't care if it intersects right we've already established that we don't care if that intersects so i'm just going to cap this very quickly and a trick that i use often is i'll just cap something and in this case it's going to cap both of them i'll just extract that because it's fast bring this back join this up so and the goal of this is I want to create a bad mesh, but I don't want to create a, just a horrific, awful mesh because I want to talk about what we can do quickly to make this less bad. So I'm going to just mirror that window because I know that window was good and join this up. I'm going to leave this and I'm just going to mesh it so that we can see what it looks like. So let's just run that. And I'm going to hide that, and we've got 106 naked edges, okay, and they're kind of, might be able to see it better in wireframe. You can see they're kind of all over the place, right? There's some there, there's some there. Well, how can we get this put back together? There's one right there. If this was what you were handed, it doesn't pass. doesn't pass cell open mesh, it does light up, it doesn't pass naked edges because there are naked edges, okay, so we can't print this. If I send this to print, the, the printer is going to have to do something with it, okay? So Pascal showed me this recently and it kind of blew my mind a little bit. Um, match mesh edge, ratchet mode on, distance to adjust 0 0.001. This is how much it will let the open edges move to see if they can find something else to grab onto. So I'm going to just pick it and let it run. And let's take a look. Okay. And it's starting to come together. Notice that one went away. With this ratchet mode, what it does is it allows you to run the command a little bit at a time. Notice this is starting to close up now. We have just a little piece up here. So it got everything except if we run this, there's just seven edges. So let's zoom to where those are and they are right there. Okay, you've thrown up your hands and nothing else will work. You have to go in and manually fix this thing. Well, there's mesh repair tools. What if we were to do something as simple as patch across there, which gives us two nice holes, and then mesh repair, mesh repair, Fill all holes. Oh, piece of candy. No naked edges, no non manifold edges. So we've just taken a garbage mesh from a garbage model from an animator that hates us and turned it into something that is now printable. 
and we can verify that just by quickly sending it out make sure this is not checked boom file successfully written all right so you know you're pretty much good to go well let's talk about one last thing I want to talk about let's say there was an extreme thing here and let's let's mess this thing up let's go uh, let's extract some faces let's just do this and let's mess this up oh should I be brave and here we'll mess up something hard all right all right so I just made two awful holes in this because we've already already established that the animation department hates the design department and wants to make our lives miserable all right so I need to go in and actually either make a new surface in here or somehow deal with this and sometimes the easiest way to deal with it is to go and this is really tedious but if we come in and just patch a single face from here to here oops. sometimes this is easier to do in wireframe because what you have to do is actually get the get the edge itself so I want to make that edge so if you see what happened there it went in and actually patched a face now my goal is not going to be to go in and patch every single one of these my goal is going to be to break this up into logical areas where it could then be hole filled so let's say I run that again Mesh. And this may not be the greatest example but I just want you to be able to see how this would work so let's say I want to kind of follow this line so I want to create I want to finish that line and I want the edge no I don't want that edge I want this edge and I want to go right to here so see how I kind of completed that line now I can mesh and I'm telling you this is tedious I've had to do it so now I can fill that hole see how I can start piecing that back together same thing in here now this is a big hole and if I just patch straight across this there's gonna be a big facet there so I'm gonna to need to be very careful about how I do that where I have to kind of build up this area in here that I can then kind of chew into this all right if I just fill mesh holes you can see what happens if I just say fill hole okay not so good so you have to come in and break this up into more reasonable pieces all right I'm gonna spare you the the details of me going through that entire thing but let's talk about let's just I'll show you down here because it's a little bit bigger thing so I want to repair patch single face in this case I can pretty much go from here to here and then I could even go from here to here and then I can fill this hole okay so that starts to make sense so you see how that works so instead of patching this whole thing you're going to want to break it up into smaller pieces and then use the patch hole tool all right does that make sense any questions on that